So Lance, when we were talking earlier, you, you shared a story about heart. Can I ask you to share that again? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So right, I, like, I'm a numbers, I'm a CPA, like accounts have little tiny hearts, right? <laughs> so I, I get involved with this microfinance organization that we talked about. I'm on the board and the charity event is coming up and the group says, hey, that guy's got, you got energy. We think at the event, you should make the ask for the money. I said, no, right? I, I don't want to make the ask. Who, whoever wants to be asking other people for money, forget it. They said, no, we really think you should. Please agree to pray about this. I mean, what, I mean they kind of got you there, right? right. So, no, yeah, so you can't said, say, fine. no, I'm not going to pray about yeah, it. Yeah, you, but, but you can, you, fine, I'll pray about it. You know, I'll get back to you tomorrow after God tells me it's okay to do what I want to do. So I pray. <laughs> God says, you know, I feel pretty clearly. He says, yes. Tell, tell him yes. I go, this is, I don't, I'm uncomfortable with this, but okay, guys, yes, I, God told me to say yes. And so um, now the event's getting closer, right? And I go, God, this is your problem. This is not my problem. You're the one that told me to say yes. What am I going to say? And just, just like, give me the words and we'll give everybody can give a lot of money and this will be great. And God says, I want your heart. And I'm like, I feel like he's saying, I want your heart. I want your heart. I'm going, listen, I'm an accountant. Money is a lot to me. I'm giving money already. You got my heart. Let's move on. What, I want your heart. You know, I want your heart. And what do you mean by that? I, yeah, what do you, exactly. <laughs> what, what do you mean? And I feel like God says to me, Lance, I want you to love those people on the other side of the world that are benefiting from this charity the way I love them. And That's a big ass. That is scary, right? It's like, I know I'm not that smart, but it was really clear to me that if, if I said yes, that I would try for that, it would change everything in my life, right? I mean, time, talent, treasure, network, you know, the whole, the whole thing. And so it's like, God, I'm not really comfortable with this. And you know how that is when the Holy Spirit's telling you to do something and you're saying no. And oh, you're, you're doing away. a little arguing. And, yeah, and, but, but he doesn't let go, right? And so I'm like, and it's getting closer to the event. I got nothing to say. And finally I say, okay, God, I, I don't. I'm going to move forward here. I can't love them like you do because I'm not God and you are, but I'll make an effort to love those people the way I love my kids. I'll, I'll, I'll make my best effort. And that seemed like good enough to God. <laughs> well, it's a pretty big effort too. Yeah. I mean, it's, you know, yeah. you, you don't love things as much as your kids. Yeah. There, and there that, that and that's a big deal for me. And I, and yeah, I, I get an emotional thing about this. And, and so anyway, that, that's how that story kind of at least got me to the making the ask. Okay. I want your heart. So you made the yeah. ask. What, so, what oh, yeah. So, I, so we're, I'm there. And, you know, there's a big group of people. And so I just tell the I want your heart story. And I probably cried. And, and I gave more money by the grace of God. My wife and I gave more money than we planned, of course. Uh -huh. and, um, and everybody else did, too. So it just God moved in the thing. And we just blew the goal out of the water, I'm sure. And... God was glorified, and I moved towards Jesus. So when you talk about moving towards Jesus, which I think yes. is so valuable, um, describe what that means to you. How do you feel about that? Um, I just, uh, I'm a sinner, and I will get stuck in myself, left to my own devices, and I just, I've realized that, um, that uh, if I can push the sin out of my life, and look for God's voice and move towards it, my life is just better. It's just all better. Better's good. Yeah. It's still hard. There's still hard things, right? Uh -huh. But I do it in God's presence, and it's the way it's supposed to be. Well, and I, I think that's the, that's the answer to, to why you're more blessed to give than to receive, hmm. right? Because it's not easy for people to understand that, yeah. right? And, and so... You didn't start out to do that. That wasn't why you did this thing. Yeah. But that was a result. That's right. And it was an amazing result. That's right. And it led you to doing it more often. Yes, I'm hooked. Thanks for sharing the story. Mm -hmm.